are 39, 39 days out for my first ever bodybuilding competition that I entered last minute. I'm terrified. We're on our way to the gym. And today is going to be my first day actually working at this gym. Not only am I going to be working out, I'm also going to be working there as an employee. And so I think uh, I'm not actually going to get to my workout till after I've kind of gone through my, I think today's kind of my training day. I might be early enough to do my cardio first, which would be nice to get that out of the way. 30 minutes on the Stairmaster, but I'm kind of nervous. It's like my first day of school, you know? This morning for breakfast, I had 100 grams of egg whites, two whole eggs this morning. I also had some 92% lean uh, ground beef that I had just like laying around. Threw it in there, that was, that was like 90 grams of that. And that was delicious. The spinach, the eggs, the ground beef. Really, really good breakfast. And I also had 70 grams of oatmeal with one scoop of protein powder and one serving of PB2. Yum, yum, yum. Love me the PB2. I actually didn't weigh this. I didn't weigh myself this morning. I forgot. And I'm just now realizing I didn't which is kind of annoying because I've been trying to weigh every single day. But I felt light, so we'll just assume that it would have been a good weigh-in had I remembered. Ugh, dude, I got I got a bunch of a bunch of canker sores in my mouth. Ugh. Literally the worst thing on earth. I've been getting them since I was zero. But we are here. As you can see. Uh, let's get in there and try to do my cardio before I start my shift. What? Start my shift. Oh, I'm a grown up. That's annoying. An extremely slow water bottle filler. Pro tip for you, put a towel over the screen so you can't read what time or how long you've been on it. it makes time go by a lot faster when you can't see the actual timer or stopwatch going up. All right, you got a phone? What kind of phone is it? Just a good one, I guess. What is it? iPhone 14, maybe? You know how to swipe down the exposure? Yeah. Oh, bro. I know everything about iPhone photography. Oh, yeah. I've been Hi. Dang. Okay. Hi. That's Canon. He's my co-worker. He also works at this gym. He's my new co-worker now. So, yeah. Shift's over. Work at time. I can't believe I didn't switch to this gym sooner. I wish I had. Working out in the open air, something, something different about it. I mean, it's brought the level of my workouts or the quality of my workouts up substantially. Like if, like if I have a pretty bad workout, I feel like here it's still a better workout than it would be if I had a bad workout on my own on my old gym. Just from being outside, you actually get a little bit of sweat. Your heart rate gets a little bit higher. You definitely feel a whole lot better though. The floor is raised up. 
Uh, although, my back is kind of hurting today. I don't know if it has something to do with, actually it's not just today, it's been hurting a little bit over the last few days. It's been a little lower back, it's been a little, ooh, you know what I mean? And I'm thinking it has something to do with um, diet maybe, I don't know. You know. Not having a lot of food in your system to properly cover and repair muscle fibers. But pushing through it, feeling good. Man, it's been it's been like six what time is it? Six hours, seven hours since I ate uh, my breakfast. That I talked about earlier, you know, the egg whites and the spinach and the, the oatmeal, whatever. And dude, I need carbs. I need carbs bad. Which reminds me, I am so like in my head about, um, and like kind of concerned about uh, peak week or like refeed days or sodium content and you know all the things that you're supposed to worry about all the things that a coach is supposed to kind of help you navigate through I'm just gonna have to wing it <laughs> yeah that's kind of concerning like how do I how do I know when it's a good time to like cut carbs or increase carbs or all that good stuff Okay, so they changed the lighting in here. It's a lot uh, cooler now, not as yellow, which I like. Oh, uh, shoot, okay. Uh. I don't know, is it, is it, did they, are you supposed to do it one way or the other? I don't know. I wish we could do this pose. I could do this as part of my like personal one, but you gotta do this other. I'm pretty sure it's <sighs> supposed to be like a, more of like a 45 degree angle there. Huh? On the back. Um, I think it's supposed to be like 45, right? I have no 45 idea. 45 what? Degree angle. From where? Oh, with your arms? I think so. No, you know you gotta spread your light a little bit more. It is good. I have a weird thing where like my right side naturally sits higher than my left. Oh, I have that. I have that too. I mean, I used to have that. I don't know what happened. It's still there. It's, this is the one I'm worried about. Oh, shit. What? This is the front one? Like, I don't know. You're supposed to go like here. Chest? No, the, like this, the mandatory one where, you know, the, you know, they go to, the, with the board shorts. And oh, like, that's, that's a, Chris can show you. Chris, ha Chris knows that pose like perfect. Does he? I mean, I'm hoping like, when I like little, when I get you want to introduce yeah. yourself. No, I don't want to be on camera. Well, you're, never, it's already recording. I mean, you can just say, "Hey, I'm Cannon." No, that's good. Say hi. Chris would love to. They're gonna. I mean, I already. <laughs> <laughs> Silly goose. Silly boy. I'm done. I need to go home and eat. I'm so hungry. So we've upgraded from cornflakes to raisin bran uh, with oat clusters. Granted, it only allows me... Granted, because this is like a more sugary cereal, I get less of it. But in this situation, less is more. Because uh, cornflakes can't, yeah, that's not gonna, not gonna work.
That's it. That's all I got. 20 grams. 20 grams. That's it. Not a lot, but it goes a long way. Oh, yeah. Dude, Razor Bran is actually, like, low-key goaded cereal. Those raisins, they had a little, like, a little gift in there. A little surprise. Burst in your mouth. A little chewy. Mmm. I think Raisin Bran gets a bad rap. But it has to be. It has to be the one with oat clusters. Because the regular Raisin Bran, it's not crunchy. It's not crispy. But this... She says crunchy there? Yeah, this one. Okay, then for my smoothie, I'm gonna do something a little bit crazy. I'm gonna put half a banana in here. I know. But Parker, there's so many carbs. Guess what? These bananas are going bad, so they need to be eaten. So we're gonna put about half of it, and then we're just gonna eat the rest of it. Blur this, blur it. Even that was way too big. All right. Okay. Um, so I just ate dinner. Hasn't been that long since I had my post-workout meal. Um, but I was still hungry afterward, obviously. So I had dinner a little bit early. Some chicken breast tenderloins and some jasmine rice. And now we're done. 1600 calories, about 178 grams of protein. And then whatever the other numbers are. Another day in the books, day 39, 39 days out. We nailed it. I'm editing the uh, thumbnail right now. Anyway, that's it for this one. I'm already dreaming of my post show cheat meal, which is gonna I think for my post-show cheat meal, cheat day, cheat day video, whatever I end up doing, it's gonna be off the chain. And in that video, I'm going to be having an entire jar of peanut butter.